What's going on, guys? I'm just hanging out at my dad's house trying to get a little Wi-Fi stolen from him. <laughs> but any which way, if you have watched the video, which you should have because we got like 200-something thousand video, uh, views on it of where I went to the farmers where they were destroying the corn crop that he had for his cattle and chickens winter feed. Well, this is kind of a spinoff of it right here. I left the trap there and we caught a few more hogs but half of them got out, jumped out of the trap. So we're going to jump right into it. But that being said, some of this footage was shot during all that other stuff that didn't make the other YouTube. And I want to show it to you right now on how we got to that point of all, getting the traps up and, and, and whatnot and what we were going through. Hope that helps you understand a little bit. Just a little family time with my five-year-old and whatnot. And uh, if you don't want to see all that part, then be smart and scroll to the trap part of it. I get a lot of comments. People say, I don't want to see your kid play football. I don't care about your family time. I don't care about your Bible reading. I'm trying to explain to all the people that don't want to see something, there's a scroll button. Scroll. La, 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 la. All the other people that love everything I do, God bless you and thank you for being here. Let's roll into uncut footages, of unseen footages of the Y'all Y'all Show and See how these hogs got away. Let's roll. Well, Cruz is feeding the dog chicken nuggets. <laughs> I like your hair. I did an awesome job. I did not? Oh, you're going to be shy? So what do we feed the dogs this morning? Because we're out of dog food. Chicken. Chicken nuggets. <laughs> that you ate this morning? Oh, all right, guys. Me and Cruz headed to go do some hog feeding and some checking and they're cutting timber. We're gonna see them cut the trees down just a little bit. And then you might get to go work with uh, Paul today, right? Yeah. Maybe, maybe. With this big I know you're talking about my big yeah, tummy. Let me show you the big tummy. <laughs> <laughs> you know big tummy. <laughs> what am I gonna do with you? All right, well, let's go get in the car seat and get buckled in. And we'll be on our way to see what me and Cruz it's getting into today. You're bad. I'm good. <laughs> we're all bad. Oh, we're all bad. Mama's gonna get us. <laughs> there she is. Saw a bunch of them, didn't we? Yeah. They were all out in that slough. She's gonna go up that road. We're going up at her. Yeah, they were just all out in that water where I caught those beavers at. Yeah. Oh, I think I see some more. Mm -hmm. I think I saw a duck. I don't actually know what it was. Puppy dog. Yeah. Oh, you, saw, you thought you saw a puppy dog? Because it was something that was black over there. <laughs> <laughs> we saw something black. <laughs> we're in on the club right here, so crews are just hanging and looking and everything, so y'all can kind of see. We're not on no main road. Going down here to check on the hogs, ain't we? Yeah, and there's some horse flies everywhere. Yeah, them horse flies everywhere. Or deer flies, deer flies. De deer flies, yeah. Deer flies. Smells like hog. You getting out? Huh? You can get right here, step over right here. I don't want to get on. You don't want to get out? Step over right here. I don't want to get bit on something. Oh, yeah. yeah. I got it, I got it. Okay, well, look. So, what we're doing is. Yeah, we got a, a camera right there on the tree. And then we've had a few hogs coming in eating right here. Oh. There's still a lot more. <laughs> yeah, so what we'll do is, whoo, these deer flies get me. Yeah, yeah. plenty, so. Yeah. Anyway, we're trying to get an inventory is what we're trying to do on how many hogs. And I've only seen like three to four boar hogs coming to this spot only. So I might have to just slip down here and just bust them with my awesome shooting skills. Huh? I mean, I'm awesome at it. No, you're not. <laughs> I'm like Dead Eye Jones here. You know, I'm just like, bye bye, bye bye. No. <laughs> I'm a terrible shot, ain't I? Yeah, the only way I, that's why I'm a trapper, because I know they're in a trap. I can get them that way, but I can't hardly get them when they're walking around out there. But you're a pretty good shot, though, aren't you? Maybe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to check this spot out. <clears throat> See, they've been kind of ruffling it up. Got it uh, dead, you know, around here. So, can you smell it? Do you smell anything? A little bit? Yeah. A little bit? So, smells like your pooch. No. 
<laughs> Mama gonna get on to us talking like that, ain't she? She'll get on to us, won't she? She'll be like, y'all don't need to be talking like that. Boo boo. This <laughs> a boo boo. Boo boo. Well, let's get this spot uh, finished up and. Uh, and we got a next spot. And the next spot, I don't know how many hogs it is there because I don't have any cameras there. But they've been eating like 100 pounds of corn a night. <laughs> yes, they have. It's over 100. It's over 100? Oh, it's over 100. Okay. Look <laughs> well, how much corn is Yeah, there was 100 pounds here and it's only like 10 pounds left. So, yeah, it's only like 10 pounds left. So, it's really dry. And they're cutting the timber over there. They're cutting, cutting timber. the timber. They're cutting timber. Timber! Yeah, they're cutting the timber over Unspeakable there. Unspeakable said when they were chopping down trees, they said, Timber, timber! That's what Unspeakable yeah. said? Yeah. Hey, if y'all are on this channel, go to the Unspeakable channel and comment and tell Nathan. Is that his name? Yeah. Tell Nathan. He has like millions of views. He has millions and millions of followers. So y'all go tell Nathan over at the Unspeakable YouTube channel that Cruz and Yacht Yacht said hello. So he needs to come over to our channel and tell you hello, don't he? Yeah, I'm like, yeah. <laughs> you guess? <laughs> you know where he lives. He's probably like two hours away. He's like two hours away. I don't know where he lives. But uh, anyway, Nathan of Unspeakable, come over to the channel and just say, hey, Cruz. <laughs> See it? Where is he? Oh, you're running for that in that woods. <laughs> yeah, you just run up into an amp bed. Uh oh. Yeah, it was just run up in them woods. It was it, it, the me, thing. Me and Daddy saw what he did before. You did? We ran over it and, and we backed up on it and we just we saw it. Oh, goodness. He oh, didn't goodness. Even die. Oh, good. Yeah, a lot of times those things can flatten out a little bit when you run over with a tire. Yeah. They just kind of flatten out. But uh, it's like a little black racer or something. I saw what it was and I was like, get out of the truck, get out of the truck. <laughs> yeah, you're screaming like crazy. I wasn't. I was trying to, was trying to do my seat buckle. Yeah, you're trying to get back buckled back in, wasn't you? Yeah. Oh, get buckled in with Spider Man. And maybe we won't run into more snakes. I just want you to see him. What if we saw a python in there? Oh, uh, if we group. see a python, we're staying in the truck. <laughs> yeah, if we see a python in that group, no. Yeah, no, it was just a little low. I don't know if you call it chicken snake or black racer or something. We just seeing all kinds of things today. Yeah. All right, we'll get you finished up, buckled in here in just a minute. We, we just have to. and then we, we just gotta we just gotta well I know but we just gotta go like right around there so we gotta get on that road so we'll probably get that one but anyway. And he attacked it. Only puts it in his mouth long ways. <laughs> uh, anyway, I just got back home. We didn't get all the work I needed to get done. You know, it's, sometimes it's, it's uh, you know, with five year old sometimes. But he got tired. Of course, you got to realize I'm driving thirty minutes that way, and I need to go forty minutes that way, and then forty minutes home. So what we did, he just got tired, sleepy, and uh, when he was riding the car, he was kind of dozing off. So what I did is I just got home. And uh, he's already in the house. I'm cooking me some chicken nuggets. He's not hungry, but I got him laid in the bed. I told him he could watch his uh, iPad for 10 minutes, and then he had to take a nap. And he said, yes, sir. So anyway, that's what we're doing. What you doing? Huh? Give it to me. Give it to me. Too hot for this. It's too hot for that. <laughs> so anyway, get back here with my chicken nuggets. Oh. My cord. Anyway, I still got a lot more work to do, but I'm gonna let him take a nap, and I just had to do it this afternoon and uh, whatnot. So it's just a day in the life of y'all again, and uh, y'all just stay tuned. You never know, we might knock something in the head <gasps> before the day's over with. Come on. The lunch of champions. Oh, you gotta be. Sh <laughs> <laughs> My wife's going to kill me. Well, she's 
she'll never know. Well, the nap didn't go so well. <laughs> oh, yeah, so we're no more tired. So we're going to put a hog trap together and get a go on a ranger ride to get a. Yeah, y'all are going. And we're going to put a trap together. And we're going to video. And we're going to video. So let's go figure out about putting some hog trap together and try to save some more corn, help the farmer save the corn. We got a little mud hole here. Uh oh, I, I want to check something real quick if I didn't make too much of a mess. Me and Cruz. I thought I saw some tracks. I want to make sure that ain't hog tracks. It's just deer track. Ooh, that's a hog track. Ooh, that's a hog track. Ooh. Yeah. Yeah, we got hog tracks, folks. So, uh oh. Granny ain't gonna like that. Ah, dog. And I hadn't seen them on my camera in this trap. That's hog tracks right there. So. And, I, I, and I saw, and I saw like five frogs. Five frogs. <sighs> so what we're doing is we're going out here to get this camera because I need it on this other job. And I'll tell my buddy Philip, bake this trap back up and uh, whatnot. But that's hog tracks. I seen them. Wasn't a whole lot, but I seen them. How you doing, Bruce? You holding in there? You good? It's gonna get hot when we get to that next trap, though. So, I'm coming to get the camera system. Still up and going. But, uh, all we had was a bunch of raccoons going in the trap, disking that ground up. But I saw haul tracks right up there, Cruz. So, I'm gonna get Granny and uh, Philip to come back down here and bait it up the trap up and then when we get done with this job we're going to we'll uh oh, we'll come back here if they got holes going in there but anyway right now they don't but and one reason could be it's wide open land yeah i don't know but anyway we'll figure it out let's get the trap i mean let's get the camera loaded up and go to the next spot fingers 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 in it? Yeah. No. Huh? No. <laughs> Think I can get this right here? It takes a strong man with a big belly. Big superhero belly like I have. I can do that. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> the hogs have just destroyed this cornfield right here. Just destroyed it. So y'all have seen, the corn was very much taller. And now the hogs have beat it down. Like I said, I caught 21 over there. He has caught 23 in that bottom in a homemade trap. But the man just went and bought him his own big pig trap. So what the plan is right now is to have a trap here and a trap down there. And hopefully we can hit these hogs uh, a little bit faster. Like I said, he uses this corn for uh, his cows and his chickens during the winter time uh, as feed, but he's lost it. So due to these pigs, and people's always like, leave the pigs alone are the weak people that don't understand life. This feed, all this feed could have been for uh, his chicken to make sure they're laying eggs and for his cattle for winter feed, but it's destroyed and gone. Uh, so anyway, now the head knocker's here. Well, I'm getting that to put together. I'm trying to figure out if we got any service or not. But anyway, we're getting trapped together. He had to go back and get his box. It's got the trigger and all that in it. So I'm hot. I'm gonna take a break. Hey, Cruz. Is it hot out there, or what? Yes. It's really hot. I'm about to uh, give out a little bit. Yeah, no. Oh, yeah, you are. I'm hot. <sighs> anyway, we're going to catch some pigs here? Uh, yes. We catch some pigs tonight. You going to come get them with me? Uh, yeah, I don't know. You going to get up? You ain't going to get up? Mm -mm. You ain't going to get up. I don't want to get up either. Oh, Mr. 
Brad. Mr. Brad went and got us. Look at that. 95 degrees. Mr. Brad went to go get that other piece and we can just chill and then we can go. Get off of me. I ain't asked you to get on me. What are you looking at, Mary? Your teeth? <laughs> <laughs> Show them teeth. <laughs> oh, it's hot. It's hot, boss. <laughs> it's so silly. All right, guys. Trap's been tested. And the cable's are off both ends, and it's ready to drop. I'm about ready to drop, too, <laughs> with all this heat. We got another trap down here. We're gonna put a little corn in. And uh, maybe they'll eat on this corn since they didn't took all this corn. All right, we're gonna put a little corn full of fresh corn in there. That's where we caught the 21 hogs right there. Caught 21 here now. Like I said, he caught 23 down in there. So we're gonna put a little corn in there and uh, we'll be on our way. That boy said he had to get the bathroom. He done come out of his clothes. He down in his underwear. He's ready. He said, soon we get to the house. <laughs> oh, oh, boy. Anyway. It's hot, boys. It's hot. But this spot right here, they uh, they just come in here last night. Caught 21 here. It's been a week. A week and been 10 days. So he bought a trap, put a trap up there. Got a trap here. Let's see what we can do. It's hot. It's hot. You don't look as hot as me. Huh? <laughs> it's hot. All right. Here you go in your seat. Where's your shorts at? <laughs> that boy's there, you got boo boo. <laughs> uh, me too. Uh, let's, get to, let's get to the house. Uh, hey, thanks for helping me today. Even though you don't look as sweaty as I am. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's probably not hot today. It's not hot to you? No. It's 95 degrees, son. I had it at a strip. Oh. oh yeah. We're going to the house and see what else goes on. Yeah. Got one of them situations this morning that I don't like. As you can see, the corn's gone now. Farmer cleaned it up, but I think I had some hogs jump out. We'll look at it here in just a minute, but I think I got hogs that caught four big hogs or four good hogs. And I ain't seen but two in there on the thing. Maybe he's laid down out of the way, but feel like we got a problem. <clears throat> yeah, he didn't clean all that up. Got it bush hogged down because that's all it was good for. Oh. Mm, mm, mm. If you've watched the other videos, you've probably seen where they just demolished this corn, the hogs did, and then I've been out of town. And since we've been out of town, he been feeding these hogs corn coming in. And now I don't know if my eyes are deceiving me or these hogs done jumped out on me after we didn't spend all this time in corn. And it's just so aggravating. <sighs> yep. Two. Two of them done jumped out. <sighs> so aggravating. Two small ones. But that's the big small Something that, but you ain't got two. Pick up sale, though. What you doing? Yeah. I thought I was right. Oh, so aggravating. 
so demoralizing. Now, one thing about this is, she ain't, if, he ain't, if I can get her knocked down, she ain't gonna be having no more. That's the sow right there. And then the guys, that's a big sow. I know y'all might not be able to tell, but that's a huge sow. Huge sow. If that was a boar hog, we'd be weighing it. I'm not gonna weigh her, but I'm just so frustrated, guys. Y'all don't understand. When it comes to catching hogs, I want 100%. And for them to jump out of this trap. Uh, and this boar hog, I mean, I'm sorry. The, <laughs> what's funny is I, I'm reading boar, and then I say boar hog, but oh it's just so aggravating man oh for them to jump out they were here at four o'clock this morning and then i went back to check the camera now the farmer's gonna see he had his camera set up here on the side and he's gonna see if i'm sorry I'm trying to make sure the light's right he's gonna see if it's on his camera if you jump out i told him i said somewhere between 415 and 420 uh there's that little section 421 so there's a little section that i didn't see and then from the time i left the house to i got here which is about 30 30 minutes Another one had done jumped out. And then when I got here, that one tried to jump out. The little one. And I'm like, but the big one, she didn't do nothing. She she acted very weird. Whether she had done knocked herself silly, whether she had done knocked herself silly, or she's so pregnant and just give out from the heat and everything of being in here, uh, you know, whatnot. I don't know. Maybe she just was very calm. Very calm. And that's not normal uh, in the daylight. So anyway, but we got to knock down. It is two sows taken out of this piece of property, but it's just so it's so demoralizing. I, I, I want to be professional like myself to to lose pigs, and we waited all week till I could get back to catch these hogs for jump out, and he's a giant. But the farmer has a trap. I'm leaving my trap here, so I'm just gonna take my camera to another spot that I need to go to, and and. We're gonna set it up, his camera over mine, and he can drop. And if he does, he said he's just gonna run down here and shoot him. If he does, he'll call me. And we're gonna see how big that dude is. But, oh, I'm so aggravated, so aggravated. Oh, let's get it up and get these things loaded up. Look at the horse flies, dude. This is what we're dealing with. Yeah, they come to that black top right there. Golly. Woo. We had a ton of action. So, but we had fun because I didn't know what I was doing. So it made it a little bit more fun, you know. Well, that's the way I am over there. <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing, but. Yeah, oh, it's going to be you. Oh, you're going to have a lot of fun. <laughs> 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 Let me get this dude turned around. She is huge. Yeah. You going to cut her open? No. I will. You can't have our lead. <laughs> You probably ain't done. I bet she is. I know she is. Look at that. Yeah. Let me get some dirt on for you. This way, that way is minimum. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Just stop, buddy. One, two, three. <laughs> Woo. Thick mate, right there, buddy. Two hundred. She two hundred. Two hundred pounds. You gonna wear? I got a scale. I can go in the front end loader. Uh, 
Well, we can do it when we get up yonder. Yeah. Whew. Catch my breath. dump them hogs off and now uh, I go get some I gotta get a battery from his house and whatnot and then I'm headed on to the next spot but my feelings is hurt guys my feelings is hurt but the farmer told me he said hey man he said they always said if you don't want to lose a calf don't raise cattle if you don't want to lose a pig don't be a pig trapper kind of makes sense but still still sensitive right now i'm still sensitive <laughs> let's go let's go old dusty road the sun shines coming up Whew. and we're on to the next job hogs are in the yard and of course, this is kind of like the front yard, but it's kind of the pasture part of it. And you can see where the hogs are getting into that. I've got a little heartburn right now. Any which way, I appreciate y'all tuning in this episode and uh, and whatnot. Even though as disappointed as I am about losing a pig, I just had to get over it. But I'm going to have to lick my wounds just a little bit longer. But any which way. Y'all get ready for another episode of trying to catch these hogs in somebody's yard or between them. I don't know. It's 100 degrees today. <sighs> I got to get it. Anyways, y'all have a good one. God bless. And as always, Jesus loves you. <laughs>